bloodshot eyes. Ladies and gentlemen, it's just gibberish. Now, here's that. Uh, uh, Marcy Morrison is our guest, and she uh, she wrote the book Finding Your Passion, and uh, and uh, it's a pretty cool uh, it's a pretty cool concept. That really, what it comes down to with you is is uh, it comes down to finding, uh, looking into your passion and what else. You you added something on the break right. that I want to add to your this. abilities. Well, you had asked about the blueprint, and the first yeah. blueprint is obviously uncovering what you love to do combined with what you're good at. So your passions okay. with your strengths. Okay, so wow. passion and strengths. And then if you find out that activity is illegal, what do you do? <laughs> <laughs> Where do you go next? Boston cream pie. Right. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, all right. So what's the second one? Give me another. The second one is trust your gut and believe in yourselves. Because a lot of times people will say, that's great that you want to yeah. be in music, but that's not going to be possible. You know, what, what, what is it that uh, causes, Paralysis by analysis. Yeah, that's right. Causes people to just go, oh, God, yeah. I feel this is right, but I'm going to do what I, or, yeah. I don't know. You your know, parents are only. I mean, really honestly, I, I, think, I think it starts way younger than that, and then, which is, I think is why it's great that you're that you're putting this as, as curriculum into people, young people that are trying to make decisions. In because, charter schools, that's a whole other issue because probably the regular school is like, oh, you're not a teacher, you can't, you're not a union, you can't teach our kids. Yeah. Yeah. We'll, we'll work example. on penetrating that but, too, yeah. overtly. Ooh, so, trust, so, 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 so trust your gut. That's pretty good stuff. Right, what else you got? We got uh, market and sell your strengths. Okay, because the, the, this is a big one. So marketing and selling your strengths, uh, the, those that might be obvious to you may not be obvious to other people, I'm assuming. Right, exactly. So, what, for example, a lot of times first, I had a friend that wanted to be a yoga instructor, but she mm, went yeah. out there and people would say to her, you, uh, sorry, you don't have any teaching experience. And she would yeah. say, well, I need to teach to get teaching experience. Right, yeah. So one day she went to one of her yoga classes. The teacher failed to appear. She stood up. Stepped up. Stepped up and said, yeah. you know what? I am a credentialed yoga teacher, and I will teach this class. And everyone said yes. yes. The facility ended up hiring her because she was out there ready you know, to that, that, You know, Ray, we've, we've talked forever. I've, I tell people all the time that, that, you know, that's how radio works. It's, who, it's whoever's there gets the gig. And I'm mm -hmm. assuming that's probably the way it is in corporate America. Yeah. You know, Especially I, when someone doesn't go up, someone's got to talk right now, yeah. get up yeah, there. I mean, I mean it's, it's, you know, when they say 90% is just showing up, it really is true about it's climbing the so ladder. It's so true. Uh, the, and, and some of those things that you talk about, uh, if you're not good at, but you know... Uh, you need that, uh, the marketing side of things. Is it okay to hire someone to do that part of it for you? I mean, do you, you know, analyze and realize... I can't do this part yeah. of what I need to do, so let's hire someone to do that. Yeah, absolutely, or get some training too. So, uh, for, no. Well, yeah. Do you have a button for that yeah. one? Yeah. yeah. Let, 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 me, let, let, me, let me let me ask you this about about you know people last year during what we call the Great Correction uh, lost jobs at an alarming mm -hmm. rate. And, you know, the stocks that went up, interestingly enough, were the Coleman Colleges of the World, the University of Phoenix oh, that's of the right. World, National that's University. Because right. people were reinventing themselves. That's exactly mm -hmm. right. Is, is reinventing yourself just, some, is just a way of life in a long-term uh, long career? When you Because when, you can do, you know, I, I, you know, I thought what I loved to do for a long time was one thing, but then I changed what I wanted to do later on down There's the no road. money in male dancing, but no, it was a good choice. Gay male dancing is, <laughs> yeah, is, is, is sure. on the rise. Happy birthday to you. It's fabulous. <laughs> uh, so, so is it reinventing yourself, is that part of what, what we're talking about? Uh, and I think also expanding your skill set. I have one friend that was high-level administration in healthcare, yeah. realized that you know a lot of things are going high-tech right yeah. now, so diversified yeah. is healthcare, yeah. high-tech. So a lot of times it's, it's expanding your skill set. I learned that in uh, doing news. I was told yeah. by the anchor Let to you. learn how to edit. Hold on, Russ. What? Let Here's Nails. Rusty Nails. That's right. This just in. Rusty Nails fired from three news stations. Back to you. No. Uh, but learn to do everything. The editing, the shooting. The, that's uh, right. As yeah. much so that you're harder to fire, yeah. basically. That's, yeah. that's if exactly. You're the so, are you, are you, so, so, you know, in, in, in your book, by the way, the name of the book, Finding Your Passion, uh, author Marthy, Marcy Marthy. Stop it. Marthy. Marcy <laughs> Marcy. Are, are, you, are you saying that you're the product? I mean, am I the product? Am I the? Am I? Because Russ is telling me, listen, this you know, this radio. There's a lot of moving parts. This radio television program yeah. here. There's a lot of people involved. We got salespeople. We got the suits upstairs. We got production people. We got directors. We got producers. And he's always saying, look it, get out of it. Bye, Marcy Morrison. <laughs> the name of the book, Finding Your Passion. I want you to check out her website. Found it. Careerswithwings.com. Good stuff. She'll be back in the studio with us. Uh, we haven't come, but you're local. Come on anytime. Yeah. All right. Sounds great. Mm -hmm. All right. Just be the product. <laughs> and, and, and is that really the advice that you're giving a lot of people is, is that they are the product and you've got to understand yourself? Oh, absolutely. Because those steps are all leading up to it. If you've got to 
package yourself into a 30 second One spin. Yeah. Who yeah. are you? What do you have to offer? And yeah. be willing to be bold. I know somebody that just got their job. They were the only person to hand deliver their resume right. and have a presentation ready. Why they were stuff. the wet person for the job. Well, since you're local, you got to come back and talk to us. Man. And this since is you're stuff. the product, okay. how about a sample? Hey, hey, <laughs> knock it off. Russ and Sally. All right, Marcy, thanks for swinging by. Marcy Morrison. The name of the book, Finding Your Passion. I want you to check out her website. Found it. Careerswithwings.com. Good stuff. She'll be back in the studio with us. Uh, we have you come here local. Come on anytime. Yeah. All come right. Over. Sounds great. Mm -hmm. All right. There you go. Big Biz Show. We come back to bueno. tax tip number bueno. 27 <laughs> from our friends at Tax Resolution Services. Big Biz Show. BigBizShow.com. Don't go anywhere. Okay. All right. Good. Yeah, we didn't even find out who the hell Joe is and why he puts Using tips the in here.